I didn't realize how much pain she was in. <laughs> she looked like her neck hurt, her, her back hurt. And so I'd asked if I could rub her neck or back. And she'd say no. And then she'd say that, that that wouldn't help, that it hurts down in the bones. Mm -hmm. And we read this is one of the states of the disease. This is one of those stages. And I don't know what it feels like to hurt in the bones. It's something deeper than a, a deep muscle pain. I, I can't imagine it. I, I can't imagine what it feels like. I think my mom wouldn't let on about how much pain she was in. When the doctors told mom she had six months to a year with this disease, I said to mom, your father, my grandfather, had cancer, and the doctor said he had six months to live. How long did he live? And she said, six years. And I said, there you go, six years. You know the Weebacutus come from a strong stock, and you can be okay if you fight. But I think Mom remembered the agony of the last weeks of her father's life. And I think Mom was in so much pain that she made a decision right then and there that she didn't want that pain deep down in her bones any longer and decided to let her enemies win. We keep saying to people that it's better if she's not suffering anymore. It kills us inside but we don't want her to feel that pain anymore. So we keep telling everyone that this is for the best.